Hi YouTube, we're here with the uh, 380. Got some mods on here, uh, leading edge slats. These are just just to see what it looks like when it's flying. The slats don't really do anything other than when they hit the aileron. They're just made of paper. It's not a permanent thing. Up here we've got the uh, nose gear, and then we've got some gear door covers. Um, just want to show you how that works. And you can see those back door. Let's close those for you. It's pretty cool stuff. I'm really excited about the way it looks. But um, more excited about the way it's going to fly, guys. So let's go ahead and see that. Um, I think I agree. I thought you were bailing on it. No, it just kind of started doing some funny stuff at the end there. Okay, let's pick it up. We'll see. I'm at 41 seconds left, so obviously it should be pretty much spent or close to what we We don't run these things totally dry on an EDF just because it's scary enough. Okay, let's see what type of damage, if any. Okay, it looks like we got a little bit of scrape there. That is super minor, guys. Man, I think these slats just, the simple fact that they're leading the edge like that, which, I mean, that's the whole point of a leading edge slat, slowed it down. I'm just a little nervous because I felt like I was getting into a little bit of a tip stall at the end there, and that's why I bailed because you could see I was coming at this tank over here. And, um, but otherwise, guys, the, the landing gear um, worked great. I mean, I was really pleased with the way it turned out. Now, the other thing too is, as, as far as it goes with these leaning edge slats, um, I don't even really have them taped. I took the tape and like stuck it to my jeans or shirt or whatever so they wouldn't stick hard. And so, I mean, I don't even really have them taped and secured properly. So, which sounds ridiculous, I know, but I don't wanna rip off the finish on this wing until I know for sure if I'm gonna do slats, or excuse me, the, the spoilers and the, um, the slats. But these are more of a Kruger flap. They, they would come down like this, like on a 747 on the outboard and inboard. But on this plane, they would normally slide out from the top. It's just too complicated on such a small wing. There's just not enough material there, in my opinion. 
I suppose you could probably build it if you wanted. But the flaps are really going to help, I think. I'm just a little nervous about that tip stall and as it pertains to if the, the flaps were causing that. So I guess one thing I could do is I could, I could tape a wedge in here just to see, you know, if creating that larger wing um, really is, is helping slow down. Because I felt like it flew slower. Um, and we'll have to go back to the video footage to really confirm that or deny that. And as you can see, guys, this gear door, um, I mean, it's not, it's not without its faults, don't get me wrong. I'm sure you guys on YouTube probably have lots better jobs that you can point out, but I'm happy with the way it, it looks and I'm happy with the way it functioned. It didn't, didn't cause any adverse effect that I could tell. So keep watching, guys. We're going to have some more flights for you. Hopefully no crash footage.